Hey, it's me, Stone the Bean, and welcome back to some more SevTech Ages. Uh, yes, we're back here on the server, and today we are joined by uh, Flame Squid 5 and Dawnster Monster. Uh, P Funk Me and Bosmanian Devil were on here just a second ago, but um, uh, the server restarted and they disappeared. I'm assuming bedtime for those guys. Um, but yeah, I am here uh, murdering uh, Shoggoths, I believe they're called. Uh, I want all their uh, I want all their goodies. I want I want what's coming out of them, which is these guys, the uh, Shogoth flesh. Um, I need it. I need it desperately. Um, but yeah, guys, if you're still enjoying this series, then please do stop on that like button. Uh, also, if you're new to the channel, then why not subscribe uh, for daily videos? Please do tell all your friends about the channel um, because that would be amazing, and uh, you'd be really helping me out a lot. Right. Uh, as you can probably tell, I'm going for Abyssal Craft today. Uh, there's there's a reason. Uh, I, ooh, you hit me. You hit me, sir. I've got 85 of these now. I don't actually know how many I'm going to need. Um, but I'll, I'll just keep going until I, I feel like I've got enough. Maybe two stacks uh, will be fine. Um, what I've got is totems there with wolf on and uh, totem there with buffalo and enderman so that I can hit fast. Uh, because I have uh, haste on, you see, so so I can I can I can hastily take this guy out. But it doesn't really work. It's, it's just best to jump and whack. There we go. Um, so yeah, so uh, uh, basically, uh, I need these uh, these shogoth uh, things. Um, if I do uses on no, not you. If I click and and then press U. Uh, you can see you can make whatever that may be. Uh, I've no idea, but it's for this. It's for the uh, the statues. Uh, so if I make the decorative one um, out of clay, uh, monolith stone, and purple dye powder, um, I can get all of these statues uh, that I need rather than like leading these things around and and spending ages and ages and ages. Uh, trying to get them to do what I want them to do, which I, I've already tried. Um, can I show you? Yeah, I can show you. Uh, there, there was one in the war here, but I don't know uh, whether he's here or not. Uh, I already tried, and I got him to make like a few statues over here. I think I got like five done. Um, and I, I need seven. Uh, seven is the magic number. Uh, so I've been spending hours trying to get them to do the uh, the, the, the thing. The, the thing that they need to do. Um, and then all I do is literally, I just sort of like uh, nerdy up like so. Um, and then and then pick up these guys uh, just like so it's as simple as that uh, I need them for rituals um, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take all of these as well um, because I'm gonna need these for crafting and then that's pretty much it uh, I've led them all over this land and they managed to spawn four it's not really the best land a nice flat area would be good um, but unfortunately I've had to use this area um, so yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to collect all this stuff, I'm going to kill some more of those guys, and then we're going to head back to base, and uh, I'll try and get all the dice sorted first as well, um, so that crafting's not as painful. So give me a few, maybe an hour, and I'll see you soon. Okay, so, wow, long time later, um, I think I'm ready to go. So, I have this guy, the Hathor, Hastor, I don't need you. Uh, have Jezahar, that's this guy, so I don't need you. Uh, Neathartop, yeah, I don't need you. And Yogo Soltho, or whatever it's called. Uh, so let's, uh, let's look at what I do need. I need this uh, decorative Sithula statue. So um, I'm going to need some clay. Where's my... There we go, let's grab this clay. And then we're going to need, uh, like, oh man, I've got so much junk in my inventory. Uh, let's get rid of you. Um, okay, let's, let's try and sort this out. Uh, Alright, um, let's just throw you, you, and I need that on me right now. Uh, you in there. That'll do. That'll, 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 that'll give me the space that I need. Right, so I want to make this guy... Um, so I need like a stack of this. I got quite a bit of that stuff. Uh, decorative sithithithu do do. Uh, missing cyan dye powder. No 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 no. I I, I I made cyan. Oh I didn't I didn't. Oh man. 
this uh, this this grind this bad boy up. I thought I could get white from that one. Didn't work that way. Uh, let's let's do this. Let's try and get my grain up while I'm doing this. Let's try and make cyan as well, so so that we have everything uh, all set and ready to go. And then uh, it's, it's, this is just going to be literally an episode of like uh, crafting and setting up, but it's going to be totally worth it. Uh, so, uh, so one of you I know what I, I hello okay so that was weird uh, so we've got this guy so that's um, let's put Sifilululu in here there we go uh, then the next one uh, we have him uh, looks like we have Jahar uh, it's this guy next. There we go. So we'll grab one of those. There we go. Throw that in and throw that bad boy in there. It's just so I can uh, empty my inventory of all these dies once I've got everything. Uh, so it looks like I've got that one. It looks like I've got that one. And then it's just this one. The uh, This dude. Okay. There we go. Cool. Uh, did I make the grey one? I didn't need the grey, did I? Because I have Jahar. Jujaja, Jujaja, whatever his name is. Uh, let's throw these in there then, and then all my dyes can go like. Uh, let's try and find an empty chest. This will do. Right. Um, uh, we'll take the clay out of there. And uh, you, and you, and you. There we go. Cool. Right. So we can bring these guys out now. Uh, we'll grab those six from there as well. So I should have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's exactly how many I need. And it's these three. Uh, that need to be surrounded by these guys. Like so. And that gives me the actual statue. There we go. That's that's probably the easiest way. Is to make like a mob spawner. Um, and again that was from that tips thing. That I uh, put in last last video. Um, it's really helped me out. Uh, reading all that. That's fantastic. Right. Uh, so now we've got all those. Uh, we kind of need to actually address the fact that we haven't really done anything uh regards to um uh abyssal craft so um we need a book and it's called the necro neck necro nominominom the necro nominominominominom um is uh plant cloth which is uh that stuff yeah uh, okay, we can do that. That, that sir, uh, is easy. Let's, uh, let's, let's try that again. That gives me six, and I should have, like, a ton of that around here somewhere. Hmm. Here we go. This is the game. There, yeah, you, you, that'll do, and that'll do. There we go. So we should be able to do this. There we go. That'll get me a plant cloth. There we go. Right, so we've got that guy. Uh, then we need the Coralium Plagued Flesh on a Bone. Uh, right, so we've got the Coralium Plagued Flesh there. We need the Flesh on a Bone. Now, I know I have some, and if not, I can always go back and get myself plenty of it. It's really easy to get, actually. Ah, oh, man, there's my flower. I knew I had flowers. I bet that turns into uh, to, uh, clear dye, doesn't it? Oh, well, where's my mob dropped? Um, oh, I want that. I'm going to eat those. Uh, my mob drops. Uh, I've got one there. Uh, one there. Oh, and said, yes, that's fantastic. That's brilliant, that. All right, and then I just need four rotten flesh. Um, oh. Yeah, I've got rotten flesh here somewhere, surely. There's two. Um... Uh, oh, uh, I, I got the trumpet. I don't know if I, I mentioned this, but I got the trumpet uh, the other day. Oh, <laughs> I don't think I've got enough rotten flesh. Uh, but there we go. There's the necronomonomonom. And um, and now it's 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 kind of... Wow. Trophy case, huh? Yay me. Right, so let's, uh, let's fire all of those into there. And we can get rid of this abyssal uh, stuff. Let's just throw... Uh, a lot of junk into here. So, I don't know the mod. I don't know the mod at all. But let's open the book. And uh, forbidden, forbid, forbidden Knowledge. 
Abyssal Craft is the mod which this book is used to guide you through mainly focused on exploration with four new dimensions you can explore. The dimensions are reached through the gateway keys. Blah, 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 blah. I'll read it right now and then uh, I'll come back to you. But I kind of have a rough idea of of what it is I've got to do. So give me a few minutes, guys, and I'll be back shortly. Okay, for the first uh, ritual, um, I think this is right. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Right, so I kind of need to... I kind of need to protect this place. So, I mean, I think because I've got haste, I can get myself a bunch of cobblestone here. And then um, what I'll do is I'll like build some some sort of walls around or something that I can protect the base with. Because um, this this... This is gonna this is gonna ruin the place, isn't it? This is gonna completely mess the place up. So, yeah, I need to be prepared for that. So, give me a few minutes, guys. Uh, let me get all this uh, cobblestone sorted, and uh, I'll come back to you. Okay, so I think I'm good to go now. Uh, I've, I've basically whoa whoa where did you come from? I basically set everything up over there, um, uh, ready to go. I've built um, like a fenced in area because uh, from what I understand, a lot of people on the server have told me, uh, whatever you do, don't play this place, this altar near your base. Now, it's not near my base. It's it's a good distance away. Um, but from what I understand, what I've read on, on Reddit, uh, it's, it's keep it uh, at least 25 blocks away. I feel like that is 25 blocks. So uh, it's time to put on all of the uh, the dudes now. So let's do this, 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 this. Um, have, I, have I... Yeah, I think I've got enough here. Uh, so we'll just place them down. Is this right? This is wrong. This, this, this can't be... Is this the right ritual pen? So I've spent ages setting this up for for the ritual, and I'm not doing the ritual. I want the other pedestal, which I have to make now. So, oh man, this is. See you in a minute. Okay, so currently I'm digging down to try and find myself something called corylium. Um, it's a specific type of ore that I need. Uh, to 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 make this altar, um, it says it detected to where I was, but I don't know how low it is. I'm in the swamp, corillium, cor corillium swamp infested biome, uh, so I'm just literally. I mean, this is dangerous, but I'm just digging straight down. I need this stuff right now. Um, I'm in such a rush. I want to get ah. There you are. Oh, thank you. Alright, oh, looks like I found a nice vein of this. There we go. Beautiful. 24? 25. I think... I think that will be enough. I mean, is it worth just having a look to see whether any... Any other bits of Corillion, or whatever it's called, is hanging around here? I mean, we might as well. We've made it all this way. Might as well have a look. We are in the swamp infested biome, or whatever it's called. Um, it'd definitely be worth looking for. No, I don't think there is. Okay, so uh, it's time for me to make my way back. All the way back. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll meet you back home, guys. Okay, so now I've got my Corellium. Um, it is now time to complete uh, the last part of what I need to do today. Oh, man, this has been so stressful. Um, okay, so uh, we were, we were, we were, we were, we were making, we were making a, a pedestal, Ped, pedestal, uh, energy pedestal. This is this guy. Uh, so we're going to need the monolith stone, and we're going to need a cor corallium pearl. Uh, that is made by uh, taking some stone and corallium gen. 
crust cl clusters. I was going to say crusties then. Uh, so we can do that. Uh, that's four, uh, 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 five, six, seven, eight, and then then we can do one for nine. There we go. So uh, if we do this, uh, this, and then put like that, like that, and then this. Is that wrong? Is that is that wrong? Um, okay, let's do this, and then this. Okay, that'll make a five. Can I make a five and a four? Five, five and a four. Let's just let's just do this. Let's just do let's just do this, and then we'll do that. That's just so much easier. There we go. We'll do this, and then this, and that'll make one of those. There we go. Great. <laughs> oh man, this this bad times. Bad times today. Okay, so uh, once we get the corallium pearl. Uh, it is just a case of uh, using the monolith stone, uh, which I have in here. There we go. Uh, and this guy to make uh, this. There we go. Oh. Wow, this has been fun. This has been fun. So I have uh, these guys which I made, which uh, the crafting recipe for those is, is just this. That's that with the monolith stone. Uh, there we go. Right. So uh, now if we head over to our beautiful base over here, um, we can actually get some of this started and finally be done with this part of Abyssal Craft. Um, we just need to craft the portal to the beneath, which uh, we're going to do next episode because I've spent so much time on this episode already. I've been recording for two and a half hours. I am pooped. Uh, so this guy goes here, that one, 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 and that one goes there. Uh, then I need my statues. Um, let me go grab my statues. Uh, there we go. Uh, so the whole point of all that fence is apparently stuff is going to spawn in. It is going to spawn in. And I, want, I, I, I don't want it to spawn in near my base. Um, I don't want it to come into my base, so I'm putting all those fences around to protect my base. And hopefully, if I'm lucky enough, where did I put these guys? Uh, I think they were right in the end here. One of these, one of these, one of these. Yeah, this guy here. There we go. Um, yeah, so I, I, I'd I, rather um, anything that comes out of there does not spawn into my base and uh, murders all my animals. Because I have heard... Uh, from a lot of people on the server that they have made the mistake of uh, putting their pedestals too close to their base. Um, and and the point in case is being Ozatron. Um, yeah, he, he totally wrecked his base. So I hear. <laughs> Sorry to dub you in, pal. Uh, there we go. Right, let's, uh, let's get all of these guys into my hotbar. And then we're just going to place them. Uh, we'll, we'll do it like that. And we'll do it like that. And we'll do it like that. Like so, like so, like so, and like so. We're missing one. I could make another one. Um, but you can see these beams of light shooting into here. Look at that. So they're collecting energy. And then if I hold this in my hand, the beams of light should come to me, I think. Let me, let me stand here. Yeah, there you go. They're all trying to give it to me because they want to charge the book, basically. Uh, so that is it. All I've got to do is just kind of leave the book there and let it charge up to a thousand um, PE, which is uh, proper energy. <laughs> I've no idea. I've no idea. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm going to leave it there, guys, for today. I've, I've done so much on this uh, off camera. Um, I do apologize that it's taken so long and you're probably going to end up with a real short video. Uh, but all I want to say is thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I've been Stomp the Bean. This has been SevTech Ages and I'll see you in the next episode. Stream.